friends. Happy Sunday for me and Daisy the dog. I've been thinking a little bit about last, this last week and it's, it's a weird May. It's not our typical experiences. We've had crazy cold weather, we've had snow, and we had to celebrate Mother's Day different from usual and more from a distance. And we're not yet worshiping to get back together in our church building. But despite these weird and uncertain um, situations, I have some good news to share with you. I'm going to be a grandma. That's right. My son Matt and his wife Daniela are expecting their very first baby in November. And I'm excited to say the least. I'm wondering about a few things. I'm wondering if the baby will be a boy or a girl. I'm wondering if the baby will have Matt's dimple in his chin. I'm wondering if she might have long black hair like her mom, like Daniela, her mom. But you know what? I know for sure all those things don't matter. While I wonder about them, what I know for sure is that I love this baby already. All those other things don't matter at all. And friends, that's very much like God's love for us. God doesn't care if we've had a bad day. God doesn't care about our situations. God loves us no matter what. He loves us because he made us perfect and we are just exactly who we're supposed to be. I want to read to you from Psalm 1, 39 in my Bible, chapter 14. It says, I will praise you for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Marvelous are your works and that my soul knows very well. God made you perfect and God loves you no matter what all your traits are or what your circumstances are, it doesn't matter. God loves you without question. And now we're going to listen to a song that Nancy's gonna sing that she wrote called Fearfully and Wonderfully Made. So goodbye friends, enjoy a prayer through Nancy's song. See you next week.